Alex. My name is Beth. Hi, Beth. I'm a marine chemist at the Oceanography Center. I'm working on the oceanic carbon cycle, and I'd like to use your atmospheric data. But I'm not a marine chemist. I know, but I think I can use your data for my gas exchange work. Everything you need is in my paper. But I need your data. Will you share your data? I'm not sure that's possible. But your project grant requires you to share your data, and you publish in Nature. So please, can I have a copy? Um, I'm not sure where my data is. Surely you saved your data. Yeah, I saved it on a USB stick. Where is the USB stick? It's in a box at home. Please, can I take a copy of the data from it? I'll try and find it. Thank you for your data. You're welcome, Beth. But I need that USB back. I only have one copy. Wait, I can't open the file. But you've got what you needed. How can I read the file? You'll need the correct software, Marine MetaSoft. I can't get access to that software. It is quite hard to get hold of that software now. I'll ask my colleague for a copy. That's great. You don't need me now. Hi again, Alex. Hi, Beth. I have a couple of questions about your data. Please, can you explain the column header, Sam? Sure, that's my friend Sam, who helped me. Okay. What kind of data are in the Sam column? That's the temperature. The temperature of what? I can't remember. Are the units in Fahrenheit or Celsius? I'm not sure. Does the data meet any metadata standards? I don't know. I don't think I can use these data. I've heard that there's a group of metadata experts who can help us with this. Who's that? It's Medin. They provide guidelines, standards, and tools to make sure datasets can be accessed and understood without needing to contact the originator. They run free workshops too, to teach people how to use their tools. That sounds good. That could save me time and add value to my data. Let's go to a workshop together.